Hello friends, running kimono. Today we're going to be doing a review of the Nine Element Foaming Dish Spray. Um, it has apparently a vinegar, you know, it helps to clean. Uh, so I was kind of like not so sure about that, but you're going to see I have a bit of a surprise. So we have that same um, top. It's like a trigger spray as the Dawn Power Wash. As many of you know, the Dawn Power Wash is like the most revered amongst cleaners on TikTok. They use it for everything and it's a really great um, asset in any kitchen or to clean. I really do love the Dawn Power Wash, but this is the new product. It is by the same company, which is P&G, um, but they look identical, don't they? So you could even swap off the top sprayers um, if you only get the refill. But here it is. Um, if you guys want to stop it to read the ingredients, it has uh, vinegar properties to help clean. And I wasn't really sure about that. So if you want to pause the video to read, here you go. And as you can see, the top, we also have that cool trigger spray. That's, uh, I probably put way too much in there, but that is quite identical to the Dawn Power Wash. So there's one, ooh, a bit of a kick there of, uh, I think I put way too much in there, I'm coughing. It has a really big kick of lemon, and then we're gonna do this one, maybe just two sprays. Do you guys ever get carried away like that where you just overspray because you have a spray bottle? Um, it doesn't really smell like vinegar, so we'll see how this goes. I'm just gonna let it soak for a couple of, maybe like a minute or so, and I'll be back, so I'm just gonna let these soak. So we'll be back in about two minutes. So this is the little catcher from my sink and um, there's a lot of oil in there from coffee. That's that brown discoloration. I'm sure most of you know what that is. And we're gonna let our friend couple there. And I'm also gonna let that guy soak. It's not the cleanest. Okay, there it is. Just leave it. We'll be back. Okay, so a couple minutes later, here are our two coffee cups. This is the one I kind of went berserk with. So we'll just, you know, rinse it out with some warm water. See if this does the job. I think I put way too much uh, soap in there. So we'll just take a look. And I haven't even used um, like a scrub daddy or a sponge. Look at that. It does a pretty good job. And it it's not it's not the worst smell. It doesn't have that big vinegar bite. So I appreciate it. I know that the nine element, uh, the laundry soap that they had last year that was on sale everywhere. I didn't like it. This is not bad though. So that's number one clean. And I'm just rinsing this out with water. Not bad, pretty good. Okay, so I didn't even use a sponge, so I'm kind of impressed with this stuff, it's great. So it, it works identical to Dawn Power Wash. And here we have this little catcher. Let's give it a little. Now this has a lot of um, coffee buildup, lots of coffee buildup, so it's probably still gonna look like a mess. Okay, I'm gonna use a paper towel and just see how much comes off. So there it is. Yeah, a little bit. I think I need some like barkeeper's friend or something like that to make this sparkle again because it's kind of like coffee looking. But um, yeah, my conclusion about this cleaner, I think it's definitely worth it, especially if you're a Target shopper or a store that has a high value coupon. If you want to give this a shot, I know there's a $5 coupon floating around. Maybe worth it getting, uh, trying. Um, and no vinegar odor left behind kind of truthful when i first sprayed it i had a little bit of a cough i kind of smelt it but then it's gone does vinegar make you cough definitely worth trying for 99 cents and it doesn't have that awful vinegar um, smell and it's not bad so i would even use this for my household okay guys that's it we'll talk to you later bye